The first thing I knew, it was over a million. And by November, I got a call. We got a call from uh, Mickey Addy, who was uh, Dot's representative in New York. And he excitedly told Randy that Ed Sullivan wanted me to fly to New York and do deck of cards on what was called the Toast of the Town, mm -hmm. the Ed Sullivan Show. And it's one of the most uh, exciting things that's happened to me during my career. I did it on the Sullivan Show. And interestingly, the next morning, since I was in New York, uh, the Mickey Addy, the promotion guy, said, well, you're here, so let's go around to the radio stations and do some promotion work. And the first station we went to was WINS, WINS, number one station in New York. We go into the record library, and over there talking to the record librarian was Tony Bennett. And I saw Tony Bennett, and I thought, oh, my God. I had played Tony Bennett's Cold, Cold Heart, and because of you and those early Tony Bennett hits when I was still a kid disc jockey in Jackson, Tennessee. And there he, instead of me going to him, he came to me. And he shook my hand. He said, Wink, saw you on the Sullivan Show last night. You were great. And I thought, what's wrong with this picture? <laughs> Tony Bennett's telling me I did a great a job. Fan. So, you know, those are l little things like that that you carry with you for the rest of your life. Did you have any interactions yeah. with Ed Sullivan himself? Or? He did call me. He didn't always call the person over right. after the performance. In fact, on Sunday afternoon, I, had to, I, I hadn't committed deck of cards to memory. It's a long narration. It's about five minutes long. And so I was the first person that they ever made cue cards for. There was no teleprompter in those days, but they actually made cue cards. Didn't want to, but they had to because I didn't know it. And so uh, I thought, mm, I wonder what he's going to think of me. But after I performed deck of cards flawlessly, I may say, yeah, it's still on my uh, website to this day, that, that version on the Ed Sullivan Show. He called me over and said, uh, young man from Memphis, Tennessee, your family's got to be awfully proud of you. I said, yes, sir, they are, Mr. Sullivan. But he was very, very nice to me. Didn't always call the person over. He right. called me over, and I felt very proud about that. Uh, the only time I ever had any interaction with him.